Hey cool math gamers, do we have an adventure game for you? Welcome to the super popular Tiny Heist, an 8-bit game where your job is to sneak through the tower and steal the gems, all while being chased by very mean guards and cameras and dogs. Think you make it through? We know you can, but here are 6 tricks to Tiny Heist to help you pull off the ultimate heist. To play Tiny Heist, all you need are up, down, and left, right arrows. Your goal on each level is to make it from the yellow staircase to the pink staircase without getting caught. To open green doors, you need to find the key first. Collect gems and other useful objects by running through them. And if a guard touches you head on, game over. So what's the best way to play? Trick number one, get those guards. If a guard spots you and touches you, it's all over. But guards don't have eyes in the back of their head, so you can sneak behind them as long as they don't turn around. And if you run into a guard while it has its back turned, you can stun it and run past to the next part of the tower. Don't be afraid to go on the offensive and knock those guards out. Trick number two, be camera shy. If a camera spots you, the tower guards will start coming at you super fast. The cameras scan for intruders like you, so look for the beam of light coming out of the camera lenses and try not to cross it. If you have to wait for a beam of light to pass, use the space or Z key to move the game along. You can also temporarily turn off cameras by running into them when it's facing away from you. And if you get spotted, you'll have to make a run for it. We'll get to more about slow versus fast in a moment. Trick number three, meet the map. Take a quick but careful look at the map before you start running through. There may be a route that will help you collect the most items, and there may be a route that simply gets you through the level quickest. Decide what your goals are and then dive in. Some levels don't reveal the entire maze right away, so if that's the case, use your instincts. Trick number four, slow and steady until you're ready. Speedruns are fun, but to keep your heist going, you'll want to take your time navigating the obstacles spread across the tower maze. That is until you've been spotted, or when the pink staircase is in sight and there's nothing left to collect. Those are the best times to hold down those arrow keys and get moving. Trick number five, itemize to optimize. Besides keys and gems, other items are placed throughout the tower that can help you keep heisting. When you collect these items, they go in your inventory, and you can activate them by pushing the 1, 2, or 3 key depending on which item you want to play. The light bulb is a great item for invisible levels. Activate the bulb and the full map plus guards will be revealed. The jammer turns off camera for the level so you can't be spotted. That doesn't keep the guards from patrolling, but at least you'll be able to avoid quick detection. The banana isn't to fill your belly. While you run, the banana's appeal is the peel. Drop it in front of a guard to send the guard skidding out of the way. Trick number six, shop till you drop. The shopkeeper is your only friend in the tower. He can boost your health or sell you items to aid you on your way, but it'll cost you. Make sure you collect those gems on each level because there's no time to cut a deal. Hopefully these six tricks will help you aid and abet you on your adventure. Do you have your own secret stealth moves to win at Tiny Heist? Good luck and don't get caught.